hey guys welcome back it's the following day actually it's time for lunch girl i was filming a morning routine so i didn't have time for you like that like that i didn't have time for the vlog like that but it looks really cloudy outside and it's about to rain so i'm gonna enjoy this weather and eat um i'll update you guys as it goes up hey guys um this is many many days later and unfortunately for us there is a natural disaster in Malawi we are being hit by a storm called Cyclone Freddy so I couldn't continue because it started on Friday Saturday Sunday Monday this is now Tuesday there have been mudslides where my mom's house is we need to go rescue the kids because they're currently trapped in Jilobwe there have been deaths over 60 people are dead homes have been destroyed lives have been lost um i'll show some clips of what's going on i haven't been going to work because i am heavily affected by the storm the cable from the pole here to my house has been moving with the wind and it's causing light sparks luckily for us i come and switch off the light so so it's not a big issue i don't even know if this is cool let me work you yeah so there's the live sparks we haven't had water for three days straight if i was to look at the kitchen there's not been any water so now um i'm collecting water outside to wash dishes like i'm collecting rainwater to wash dishes that's why i'm completely wet my family is gonna come here because it's safer this side than it is where they are because of the mudslides so yeah it took a turn for the left. I don't even care that I look crazy right now. I'm just trying to survive, okay? This is the water we're trying to collect. Look at this. It's been, now it's better. It's been raining heavy for almost a week now. And because of whatever's going on, um, I couldn't wash dishes. So the ants everywhere. So I'm hoping that this water that I'm collecting can help me at least get things cleaned up. Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, this is me <laughs> after Cyclone Freddy. Yeah. So let me wear my glasses so that I can talk to you nicely. yeah that's so much better so i don't know if you know but <laughs> it's been a horror movie um malawi was hit by cyclone freddy which also hit mozambique and australia i'm not not australia is that australia yeah that yeah i'm not sure i think it's australia um yeah so we were hit by a cyclone it's one of the longest active uh cyclones in the history of mankind well recorded history of mankind it has been active for 35 days and it was raving havoc all over so unfortunately for us malawi got hit blantaya was well, southern part of malawi blantaya Molange. Palombe, those areas got hit and we were on the way of the cyclone so i'm still a bit shaken as you can see i don't have electricity because uh the cyclone ruined the electricity pole at my house so i don't have power until escom decides that they want to come fix my electricity so i haven't had power since friday and um during this time it was so scary it was raining videos of the disaster i didn't go to work for two days and uh, my family my siblings got were kind of stuck in jilobwe <coughs> jilobwe being one of the areas that's been affected the most um we've had over 200 deaths uh still have people missing just uh, a day or two ago the president conducted a mass funeral for the bodies that have been found uh families that's lost their homes are currently in camps right now um there's a company in my house 
because my area was affected by a mudslide. Um, yeah, so people's lives were lost. Luckily for me, the mudslide didn't reach as far as where I am. So uh, I'm, I was good on that end. But it was just a scary experience. And I think it hasn't really hit me how serious it was until just recently when I was just sitting and thinking and I was just like what a crazy time to be alive hey yeah so I'm gonna go into town now uh, it's the weekend there's a vlog that I started so if I, I didn't continue it I didn't even know how to continue it <laughs> but it's fine so we're gonna start this one um it's saturday we need to do our errands so we have our to-do list is we need to go to the bank we need to go to shop right or any other shop that is available to go buy cooking oil we need to buy vegetables and then we need to come back home and try fix the electricity i have a savings box here in the house which was for december i was trying to save up for december it was literally the enjoyment fund but i think uh that can take a back seat and i'm going to open it <laughs> i'm going to open it and see how much is in there that can be used in this time of crisis uh, because i need to either pay an electrician to do the lights we haven't had water since friday i've been using the um, rainwater to like get things moving at home and i bought drinking water but it seems as though um after the rains have stopped oh sorry the people cry after the rains have stopped now i need to find an alternative so what they've been doing is they've been opening the water for like an, a few minutes or an hour i don't know and then they'll cut it so because i have a geezer the water has been collecting in the geezer yeah i don't know really don't know sorry i've been talking for so long um it's just a stressful time okay let's get the day started this is my outfit for the day it's a cute uh dress long sleeve because it's kind of cold uh it has a zip this side the zip goes all the way down i think it's ridiculously cute and my hair, this is pandemic hair. I did this hair in the blackout in the pandemic. So it's not so cute, but it's there, you know what I mean? Yeah, let's go. Where's the, where's the tin? Can I see the tin? weird guys i have lights look at this escom melanin glowing in melanin <laughs> when i tell you this has been an experience and a half i'm gonna explain it all better when i wake up tomorrow but now it's 10 o'clock and i'm going to bed so see you tomorrow <laughs>